Hello y'all, welcome back. We left the farm for a little bit and it is good to be home. It's a little bit different video. Millie's happy to see us in June. We went with the family. Well, not everybody, but part of the family. <laughs> we went to Seacrest Beach and just had a really good time. We decided this summer that we were going to go into it and relax more. And I think we have. Yep. It's been a good summer. Has been. There's still lots of building projects at the school and all that, but it, we just, we needed some good family time this summer and time with our church kiddos and all that. So that's what we've done. We wanted to just do a better job of living in the moment and living in t the day to day and not, I guess, wishing for the next thing because our kids are getting big and we want to just soak it all up. <laughs> so that's what we're trying to do here. We hope you enjoy our family trip. pulling in we've been driving we started late last night and we didn't get as far last night as we wanted to because hurricane had hit texas and then moved on up for arkansas and with tornadoes and all that so now we missed the the boys car they stopped by the uss alabama so we've been driving all day and we are actually an hour ahead of the boys car now so we're pulling in, going to check into our house and go get something to eat. Everybody excited? Yep. Yes. We are ready, ready to get out of this car. Get away! Hey, Jesse, go. Go. That's what Steven says. Oh. Hey, what's up there? What if you started up there? Okay. Oh. So three bedrooms on this floor. Mom! Yeah. There's a whole bathroom in here. Oh, are you serious? Yeah. And Tatum. Stairs. Tatum's on the third floor. And you get your own little fridge. Why wow, you do have your own little bathroom? This is cool. Too. Open the windows here and perfect Bible study view. Nana 
Ryan Tatum squished back there with all the groceries. Just, <laughs> just the bare necessities is what we need to get by. Is what we yeah, got. yeah. It's like we yeah. cannot live without. <laughs> just, just six hundred dollars worth of groceries. Walmart, I mean, uh, we're, we're really we're, roughing we, it. Yeah. We are roughing it. I mean, Fine. there is ten of us, and four of them are growing boys. So, you know. yeah. Five boogie boards, three bicycle helmets. Well, two why are you talking boards. about that part? <laughs> it's so, necessities. It is necessities. We're safety first. Be worth putting those small goggles on. What? Well, might be worth putting those little goggles on. But it still gets in there. Big 
with a skin board. Rosemary's the cutest little place. That's little coffee shops, little stores. but not busy like over at Panama City. We went over there last night, ate at Mike's, what was Mike's? Mike's Oyster and Oyster Crab? Bar. Mike's Oyster Bar. We ate there a couple times. He also owns Thomas's Donuts and Ice Cream over there. He's been here for how long do you say? 30 years. No, a long time. No, it's been longer than that because he said in the 70s. I don't know, maybe he's only owned the oyster bar for 30 years, but he's worth going and visiting. We've been there. Every time we've been there, he's always there. Super friendly guy. We drove by his ice cream shop yesterday morning. It was about 10.30. Well, that's donuts, too. And the line was out the door. So, we may have to try that out sometime, too. Yep. But his son, when he's well, Mike's at the Oyster Bar. His son is running the ice cream place in the evening. This is the Pearl. It's really good. We ate there once. We ate in that cowboy kitchen one for lunch once too. It was good. And there's acai bowls and all that at one of the places. There's lots of little quaint little places to eat. Rosemary had this little bookstore, and outside was a lady selling a um, Bible study she had just written for her and her teenage daughter, so we bought that.
saw you flexing over there. Huh? Yeah, there you go. Right. Y'all tall over there. Look at there. Have a look at that view there. Yeah, we got a look at that moonshine too. I'm blue that moonshine. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I turn my finger for another night. They little fireworks over there. I love you, baby. <laughs> and if it's quite all right, I need you, baby. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. All right, bro. Just give me. Everybody waiting for you, huh? All right, let's do this, buddy. You going to try it? All right, teamwork made a dream work. Okay, don't close your eyes and try to do it now. Don't work. Okay, I believe in you. just got to believe in yourself, bro. All right, here we go. Ready? What's that there, huh? Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> all these cameras in the way. You getting camera shot. Come on. Daniel Fair. Ready? What's your name? Oh! oh. oh. A bucket? No. 
I want this. I want to keep the sand plate. Yeah, what's a sand plate? Yeah. 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 It's like a bug. Yeah. Watch, watch behind you. Oh. There's a big one. Oh, behind yeah, right here. Oh, okay. Now let, let me see this. What is it? It's a sand plate. What's it look like? Yeah. A sand flea. See it. Sand flea. Oh, we can just try to jump that. Uh, what the heck? Oh, oh look, he's moving can't now. can't see it. Go in the world. They're super good fishing yeah. bait. Really? Yeah. Oh. Do they have claws? No. Does it have a shell? Yeah. It looks like a uh, hermit crab. Yeah. Big ones? Oh, big ones. Yeah. Dad. This is the best. How can that? That's a good one. Yeah. Nice. Okay, Dan and Dustin had a uh, triathlon plan. <laughs> we biked for 20 minutes, ran a mile, and now we're supposed to swim. The length of that pool and it's ginormous. I don't know if I can do it. I'm not a very strong swimmer. The guys are gonna do it for sure. I'm gonna wait and do it with the kids. Put your life jacket on. Yeah. Phil gave us lessons yesterday. He used to be a lifeguard and uh, he told us the proper way to do it. Take him pretty fast at it. <laughs> She's my Mr. Swim Calling. <sighs> We're dying a little bit. Florida mugginess is legit. Okay, we survived. How y'all feel? Good. <laughs> How y'all feel? Good. Good? You work hard this morning? Yeah. What'd y'all do? Trying to get out of bed. I'm working on my thumb. Eating some pizza, wrestling, getting out of bed. Rough life. We completed our mini triathlon. How long did it take us? Forever. <laughs> it wasn't too bad. We 15 minute run. 20 minute ride. 20 minute ride and then eight minute swimming. Oh yeah, look at this. Much I think it was about eight minutes swimming. Dan, how are you feeling? I'm gonna make it. <laughs> I come in and Philip said, What happened to you? <laughs> Pretty sure that uh we think Phil is the most in shape. Yeah, he dad. Absolutely. Yeah. Did he, bring, did he bring his jump rope? I have a jump rope. Did you use it? I have I should go use it. Oh, I don't think I can throw in a jump rope after all that. Well, we did it. Now what's the plan? Relax. <laughs> Relax. Beach. beach. We swimming at the pool again first? We swimming or going to the beach first? Beach. Beach? Okay. Yeah. Fishing. Okay, so I guess later at beach. Uh, no. the day. Back at the beach. There is. People All smoking. Right. Dave's smoking. Dave's smoking. Getting interviewed over here. What is happening?
iron on this. Yeah, all we got is wool. Got moats. Building a wall. Titus has built some structures. Oh, my cat doesn't
hold your breath. Oh, Titus had to breathe. Titus oh. still going. Or are you actually breathing and not telling us? Oh man. Oh man, are you gonna make it? I can't do it. You didn't. <laughs> Oh, you're okay. Wait, does it count if you breathe out? No. Wait, yes, it does. You can be underwater and hold your breath and breathe out. Yeah, that you're counts. still holding your breath. So That's I'm saying that it. doesn't count. As I like breathe you in at the beginning, halfway through, I breathe the air out and then just held that. I know. So that counts. Yeah, it counts. my breath. Good job. So it worked. Okay. Thank you guys for following along. We hope you enjoyed. It was a fun trip. Lots of fun memories. Yes. It was awesome. <laughs> the kids made us laugh. We we had the best time. They are so funny. All of them. We missed David's family and Derek, Katie, and Livy. But they entrusted us with Philip. We saw no sharks. We saw a barracuda. I did not see it, but did Titus see a barracuda? Saw a barracuda, yeah. Yep, I saw it ate. Uh, guys fish off the line yeah. so that was they were fishing on the pier and then every day the water just kind of progressively got calmer and calmer so we had the fun boogie boarding waves and then we had just the nice calm clear clear water day so it was nice yeah it was a good mix it was, uh, we're blessed to have that trip we were. We stayed in Seacrest, and there's lots of cute little houses there. So if you guys are ever in that area, Seacrest, Rosemary, that whole stretch right there, super cute and just family friendly. Everybody's riding bikes around. We loved that part. The bikes were, that was just fun to get a ride on their, their they had plenty of sidewalks and bike trails and little shops and little ice cream stops. All, all the ice cream stuff. A lot of ice cream. We, we like our ice cream. So, it was a good time. What's your favorite part? Uh, I don't know. I had a favorite. Just, just getting away. And yep. Watching the kids have fun. Yeah. Cousin time was, was good. They enjoyed each other. They all get along well. They soaked it up. But there's no place like home. So, we are back. And I think... We're here to stay for the duration. At least for a week or two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then it'll be time for school to start. But we are ready to be home. Um, Cassie and Gary have some chickens rounded up for us. So we need to get our pen put together. Um, it's put together, but just get the uh, feed and water system for them. And we're ready to go pick them up. Yay. So, <laughs> whatever. You eat more eggs than anybody. Yep. <laughs> Thought you said you wanted chickens. Yes. I like eggs. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we're excited. We're ready. We had planned on meeting up with um, Nick and Zoe, and then we actually ended up leaving a little bit early yesterday to break up the drive, and they had baseball. So maybe another time we can make an Alabama trip and go visit them. Sounds like a good excuse. Good excuse to road trip. Yep. See if we can talk Cassie and Gary and going with us and go see what kind of venture we can get into. I don't know. We'll see. But for now we're gonna stay put for a little while. We need some we need some farm time. So we hope you guys enjoyed the video and we'll see you soon. God bless. See ya.